Doesn't look good, does it? Not as bad as I thought. Um. Grr. Or Halkin. Damn it. How did it end up down here? Oh, I've got no idea. Maybe it was the ore train waste. The color looks wrong, though. Yeah, I see blue and yellowish streaks. Perhaps it's reacting to its surroundings? Let's not lose our sleep over it. I'm sure she will find out. We're lucky enough this stuff glows in the dark. Well, let's find a way to get this piece of junk moving. Beep boop. Oh, see, we could have just bought them here. No. I like that this game is competent enough not to leave us stranded without items. Like, I could. I, I stocked up before we left just to be safe, but I didn't need to. We need to get the reactors going. Look everywhere. Hmm. Should... Yeah, I can't. Pa I can't pass it to go outside. Makes sense. Oh, we can save here too. We can save here. Wonder if we'll find something spooky down here. The atmosphere certainly suggests so. Hmm. I feel like the bridge was that way. Maybe I go down first. Flooding. Whoa, this side of the ship is flooded. We need to find a way to drain all this water. <sighs> well, it's just gonna be the same deal back down the other side, right? So, let's just keep going. This kind of reminds me of the wrecked ship from Super Metroid. Since there aren't weird blob things trying to spawn in on top of me. And we're probably not going to fight some weird electronic alien ghost. Weird, the terminal seems to be working. Oceanographic research data. Every year, scientists discover a new species of fish inhabiting the abyssal depths of the ocean. <laughs> One of the most recent discoveries is the Sahagin. It's an alien-looking specimen characterized by leg-like appendages. For this reason, they resemble surface creatures. This peculiar mutation might have been caused by the disaster of the Reagan Pet or Petrol Company occurred shortly at before the Haldoros Treaty. The species also features sharp claws and appears to be vulnerable to light, a rare element in the depths of their habitat. Well, if we run into Sahagans, and there's a character on our team who can use light magic, we'll know what to do. Well, we might be able to we might be about to run into something right now. Oh, oh there it is. I'm not done exploring, we'll fight later. Okay? Fight later. There's probably gonna be one in there too. Hmm. Yeah. Oh, see, that guy almost jumped me. Let's go down over here first. I have a feeling I'm gonna have to kill those things just to get this done anyway. Weird. This terminal seems to be working. Training system. Control terminal number one. The system has been restored after an unexpected reset. Please insert the password. Oh, there's a password. The password is password. <laughs> Password one. Access denied. You have not entered the credentials correctly. Please contact the system administrator. Oh well. I can't fault them for being competent with their passwords, that's for sure. More flooding has occurred over here, so we're not gonna be able to go over here yet. Oh, another hint. Weird, this channel seems to be weird. Nitrosoft mailbox. From rgraycastle at vanmail.com to dalderbaron at vanmail.com. Dude, you need to stop forgetting the password. I left you a note in your room. You better learn it or lay your revenue will have your hour hide. See you next week. Oh, so it's in his bedroom, is it? But we've got to we gotta find his bedroom. Alright, I guess we've put it off long enough. We gotta go fight monsters now. Oh, did I check this one before? Things are working. Oh, once again, from M. Kennedy at Van Mill.com to J. Lat or Labrie? Labrie at Van Mill.com. I thought I had sent it already, sorry. Password to access terminal number one is Levizoa, but the uh, vowels are all um, numerals. 
I can handle that. I read Homestuck. I can handle that. We're gonna put in the thing. The password was... Done. The system is now draining a flood in the highlighted area. Must have been the other room. Let's go. Yeah, we don't have to fight things yet. Ha! Huh. We can continue to put it off. Let's save all that stuff we did. We didn't really do much, but we're saving it. Yeah, now, now we can get in. That kind of startled me. I'm not going to lie. Not going to lie. That's some dirt noise. I think both of those lead to the same room. I'm just kind of examining. A little splishy splashes, man. They're kind of unnerving. That's mean game. Don't jump scare me like that. Oh! I saw a sparkly in there, but I'm gonna go down here. Is there a bad guy in here, too? Well, there's a sparkly in here, too, at least. This room is dry. The doors must have prevented the water from leaking in. There's some notes here. Research on deep sea animals. Among deep sea creatures, these reptiles are the most peculiar. Unlike their surface cousins, these Okeasauri are hot or hot blooded. Mm. This makes them particularly sensitive to cold temperatures. So but they're weak to ice. Another telling characteristic of this species is its unbreakable shell, which is certainly an evolutionary outcome, developed to adapt to the pressure of the depths. Okeasaurus scales are harder than the shell of a tortoise. Hmm. Well. Now we know two enemy weaknesses. A vending machine! And it's still working! I can buy things, but I'm not gonna buy things. That, that shop icon was just kinda a little... A little over the thingy dude over there. A bit far from it is what I'm trying to say. Alright you, let's go. Stand a chance against me. Oh. So I'm guessing the one in the middle is a Sahelian, and the one on the top is one of those turtles or reptiles? They're both enhanced by crystals. And well it's not like lightning is good against either of them particularly. Wait, do you think these guys count as beasts? Let's see if they count as beasts. I don't think it did. Um, this deals light and lunar damage, looks like. Oh yeah, this is the first time we fought with a galleon. Lowers enemy resistance with fire and lasers and lightning. Radiates chaotic energy causing random effects. Huh, that sounds interesting. Uh, this grants focus and meditate status effects. Hmm. Spirits. It's blocked and fail. Uh, I'm gonna generate chaos. Generate, generate chaos. Oh, that just hurt all of us. That was terrible. Maybe I won't do that anymore. <laughs> speed her up. She can strengthen up. Heals and this damage to reptiles and aberrations. Uh, these look like they could be either, but we'll try it. Stab it. Yeah, that was pretty, pretty decent damage. Nothing here is going to work the fire, and it's lightning again. <laughs> this, this was ice, wasn't it? Okay, so you're susceptible to ice if I'm reading this correctly? Oh yeah, that was definitely his weakness. So that means you're the one who takes more damage from light. Yeah? Okay. Are you a beast? Not really. If you are, that still wasn't very strong. And this costs a lot of speed. Okay, you... Uh... Oh, that just grants resistance. We don't need that. Anybody need heal? Nah, not really. Just stab it. How about that? Oh, I wonder if this, this song gonna count as a... Reptile as well. Maybe not. 
We killed it anyway. You're pretty strong, but not enough to beat me. Oh, I was hoping we get a galleon boat. Well, whatever. Beat that guy. That's a handwritten note. Gotcha. I want you to get to the password by yourself this time. Use the same logic you applied to the first password on the word Atlas. Oh, I get it. I repeat, Atlas, just switch the letters. It's going to be Fortfuls. Or Fort Lufus. The A's are fours. Wee. Let's get up here. Save the game. Yeah. Kind of curious to see what's in these rooms before we do that password thing. You want to fight? More hints. Hey, that sound seems to be working. Control terminal number two. System shut down unexpectedly. Please insert password. Oh, this is where we needed to be anyway. Gonna be. Ah, uh, oh, not that one. Oh god, it backs up too. Ah, uh, Iron2K, you're very peculiar sometimes. Access granted. Remove fluids from the cockpit in the front deck. Look, we did good. Let's fight this thing now. Leave. You don't stand a chance. More of these guys. I'm gonna strike you with a lightning. Okay, you. Uh... We don't actually have any elements that we can put in. Oh wait, didn't, isn't she the one with the thing that was good for lizards or whatever? I'm dumb. I'm dumb. I'm hesitant to spam that because it's so expensive. Ow. Dang, he took a ton of damage from that. I guess they're weak to lightning. Does not seem to count as a lizard. 78 seems low for squeak this damage. Wouldn't walk away from this fight without a scratch. Anything else happening in here, though? Anything else? Anything else? No, no, not really. Okay. Hey. <laughs> Go in here. Fight the other thing. I bumped into it. I will give it my all. They're all just these guys. All right, so you're super weak to lightning. Let's gonna do that. Uh, you might be able to finish it off. Nice. You. Nice. This guy. See, we learned. We figured it out. Wouldn't walk away from this fight without a scratch. But you did. Fox. We got an input. Hey, hey. This terminal seems to work. Roland Wing Designer notes: The Roland Wing airship has been renamed after our legendary emperor, Roland Levizel. It is a design, a redesign of a previous seaplane model dating back to the 21st century. The ship has been designed to land and stop on liquid surfaces. As an additional security measure, a drainage system has been implemented to be used in case of a leak. The carrier can take off again after the drainage process has been completed. The drainage system can be accessed through the terminals in the east wing of the carrier and in the command room. I have a feeling I was supposed to find this first, but you know what? It's fine, because we already solved the puzzle. And now we got confirmation that this hunk of junk is going to be able to fly again. Let's head on down there. Maybe I should save. <laughs> Maybe I should, like, record my progress so that I do not lose that progress. To some foul misfortune. Dang, crystals. They're, like, semi transparent. Or translucent, if you prefer. I've done a quick checkup on the engines in the control room. You don't look worried. How's the ship? 
There's some damage, but nothing my boys can fix. We just need to find a way to get the engines going. This, sh this ship is Atlas powered. What if we tried with Aura Halcon shards? Sounds risky, but I see no other way to get this load of scrap back to the sky. <laughs> the ship is full of Aura Halcon crystals. Too bad most of them are stuck in the hull. Try and gather as many as you can, then come back to me, okay? All right, ma'am. Gimme. Oh, I can't take him. You're over here now. Splish splash. <laughs> Dots. Get out of the way, Cyan. Over here. Do you ever get out of the way? Oh, screw you, buddy. You crazies. I need them. Which ones can I take? I'm gonna try and go out the other way where yeah, old Yeller didn't let me go for. Oh, it's just an invisible wall now. Aha, we can take them if they're shiny. And now we know how many there are. This place is still kind of creepy. That's two. Oh, give it! I see the sparkle, but I'm pretty sure that's just the PC. Oh no! It's okay, we can wipe these guys out so easily. I swear I will defeat you. These guys are nothing. You won't even get to attack. So we know their weaknesses. We're exploiting them. Easy out. Or maybe that one will survive that. Why did it only do 10 damage? Galleon, that was a really wimpy hit. Perhaps I was too much? Oh, yeah, see, it's, it's not it. Oh. It's kind of next to the crystal, though, so it's hard to tell. Oh no, we had to repeat Nice battle. Is there one here? Yes, there is. This monster stayed dead. How curious. I didn't need that. Hum. So that was what, number three? Gotta find two more somewhere. Somewhere out of the terrain, you know, whatever. Is it safe, boy? Oh! One in here, one in there. I see a sparkle. Oh no, not the easy fight again. It's all or nothing. Attack it. You just come in the middle. Yeah, come on. So your physical attack is pretty wimp, huh? Oh no, that time I did 465. Why? You're pretty strong, but not enough to beat me. Wrecked. Head on up here. Can I make a break for it and get it? Yeah. I was considering just fighting it, but I decided not to. Decided not to after all. Because on the one hand, they're super easy, but on the other hand, I really don't care to grind. And I will avoid it for as long as possible. I won't shy away from fights, but... Oh god, there's a bag bad. I'm really glad I saved. 